So what is going on, everybody? It is your best friend, Mr. Air HD here. Um, and we are back with another episode of Real Talk. And a lot of people asked me to do this one. Um, and honestly, I knew it was something I had to talk about eventually. Um, I'm going to get a lot of shit from this, or for this. But at the same time, I don't really care. Um, so I've been asked, especially with Forza Horizon 2 coming out, uh, when are you going to do an all-wheel drive video? Build this car, build that car, and... Uh, I specifically was asked um, if I would do uh, a video on this about my opinions on other drivetrains uh, by a couple people. So basically, unless told otherwise, nothing you've seen on my channel is not real wheel drive when it comes to drifting videos and stuff. So like, if it's a Civic, it's real wheel drive. If it's uh, a Skyline, it's real wheel drive. Uh, unless I say explicitly in the video, it's all-wheel drive. Uh, I think there's only been a couple of cases. Uh, the Hummer was one uh, that I can think off the top of my head. Everything I do is ripple drive. That's basically to understand uh, the concept or the, uh, the concept. But the reason I'm so stubborn with this is I started drifting in Forza 2. You did all-wheel drive. You got the fuck kicked out of you. Um, in terms on the forms, you get that sh made fun of and ridiculed and laughed at. Um, you know, you're a noob and this and that, whatever. Um, so I said, fuck it, I'm not gonna do that. And that and rear wheel drive to me was, you know, people in real life are doing it in rear wheel drive, so I'm gonna do it in rear wheel drive. Anyway, fast forward like eight years or a significant amount of time, let's just say that because eight years is probably the wrong number. Um, we are here now uh, in 2014, so I think it was 2008 when I started, so 2008-2009, so it's been like four or five years. Um, the, the moon has changed now. Um, back in the day, it was like, if you were all-wheel drive, even videos posted on YouTube, if you saw real all-wheel drive videos being posted, they were all dislikes more than likes, and there was nobody doing YouTube at the time, like big, um, so it didn't matter. Um, but if you had an all-wheel drive focused video, you got pooped on. Um, so I guess that brings the topic of what do I think of all other drivetrains now, here. Um, honestly, my personal opinion is my personal opinion. Whatever you want to do is still whatever you want to do, you know. Um, if it's working for you, whatever. But my personal opinion is that it is cheap and, <laughs> and newbie to use all-wheel drive. Uh, it ruins the experience of drifting. Um, it's easy uh, a lot of people say oh no it's hard I'm like no 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 listen it's probably difficult to get it right you know like to get link all corners up and whatever but just to do it like if you just want to do a u-turn uh, like a like a u-shaped corner all-wheel drive drifting e-brake gas you know there's no for the most part there's no finesse to the build there's no it doesn't matter really what you do as long as it has a lot of horsepower um, you know, it's very easy when compared to rear wheel drive. Uh, front wheel drive, I'm not going to talk about except for right now. Front wheel drive to me is just something that I think people even who do front wheel drive don't take it seriously. And if you take front wheel drive drifting seriously, you are a special breed. Uh, is it difficult? Yes, I just kind of find it silly. Um, but if, you know, if it's again, if it is drifting, you know, you just hold the uh, the e-brake and do whatever, but uh, a lot of people really enjoy uh, all-wheel drive, or front-wheel drive drifting, and I mean, I can't stop you, <laughs> uh, I think it's kind of dumb, but if it's what you like to do, it's what you like to do. Um, again, back to the main topic of all-wheel drive versus wheel drive. Uh, a lot of people, again, have asked me to cover this, and I get shit all the time, and if I ever mention it in a video, I'm like, aha, all-wheel drive sucks. Oh, uh, fuck you, uh. all right, then I'll get flame wars in the comments, and it's it's not an uncommon thing. Um, but, I mean, I came from a time where you had to be a real drive drifter, or you basically were on your own. Um, now, things have changed. Uh, I'm trying to change my mindset, I guess. Uh, I'm super elitist in the topic, I'll admit that freely. But, um, I still can't watch an all-wheel drive drifter and not just go, you know, it, it still pisses me off, it still, you know, I, and I think at this point, for the most part, the reason I don't like all-wheel drive drifters is the company that they keep, and what I mean by that is, 
whenever you go online, let's let's say you go into like an open Forza 4 or 5 drift lobby and you're in with a bunch of people and there's one guy in the all wheel drive, that one guy 9 times out of 10 will ruin it for everybody. And not because he's in the all wheel drive, it's the guy, not the car, it's the guy. You know, it's like they always have something to prove and like, I'm the best and the best all wheel drive, all wheel drive this and then and then and they just sit there talking about how all wheel drive is better and harder and it's just shut the shut the fuck up, man. Like no one cares. Uh, if you guys have been on the Forza forums for the past two years, absolutely ruined by all wheel drive drifters just coming in wang swinging their dax around thinking they're tough shit uh and just pushed everyone like me out like i want nothing to do with that place anymore um i i tried helping and fixing and it's just there's no user base there anymore everyone left nobody cares um basically that's it's just to me the attitude the, the drivetrain itself like i can look past that but there's so many people just if everyone who drives all-wheel drive seems all they do is all they talk about is all-wheel drive like oh it's more difficult and the all-wheel drive this and the all-wheel drive that um and another thing too is a lot of people used to tell me uh i drive like a lancer this is before four was a five so i drive like an evo um with all the power to the back so it's basically we will drive no <laughs> it's not it, it never has been and never will be that's not how it works uh if you've ever driven the car uh, a car that, like, a, like let's take for example, like a Skyline or something, where you can have a rear-wheel drive swap, and you've tried both, you, there's a difference. It's not... And there's still people in, like, Forza 5 and Forza Horizon 2 that are like, oh, no, I'm going to use all-wheel drive and put all the power to the back. Just use rear-wheel drive, you pansy. Like, and it's so stupid that this has to be such an argument, but, like... And there's, it's this. I, I pretty much lump it in the people who use over 700 horsepower and race tires. Like, uh, you know, it's whatever. You, you don't know what you're talking about. I've been around in this community long enough to know what the fuck I'm talking about. Um, so again, you can have whatever opinion you want. It's this is the beauty of the internet. You don't have to listen to a damn word I'm saying. Um, but I think all will drive. The community is a cesspool of morons um, that try way too hard to be good and prove themselves uh just to say that all-wheel drive is just as difficult or just as bet good as rear-wheel drive but they you know rear-wheel drive drifters don't care they don't have to prove anything because they have put in the time and the effort to get good at like the preferred drivetrain that and these games are simulators they're simulators well they're not simulators but there's they're 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 simulation based games so why, why when every competition in the world, except for Got Bill, but that's not a competition, as far as I know, um, the, 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 the rules are that the car has to be rear-wheel drive. Why is it more realistic to use all-wheel drive or better? I don't get it. I don't understand. Um, you know, for people, and just this last disclaimer, I don't want to go, I'll sit here and rant about it for like an hour, but... This last disclaimer, um, if you're like a Jim Connor person or like a stunt driver uh, and you don't really care and you just want to go out and have fun, all the power to you, dude. Uh, you, you, like the domestic mango kind of person um, that just wants to go do 360s and doesn't really care and doesn't take everything too seriously, you go right ahead. Um, I don't care. I, those people don't bother me at all. Uh, it's, 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 it's you know it's it's they're not it's it's the people that try so hard so fucking hard just be like no all wheel drive is the best and it's the best and it takes more skill and nah, 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 nah. and they try it they take it so goddamn seriously and they try to they trying to make it like the drivetrain to use it's like no that will never happen uh and it hasn't happened and you know if you want to know why go back to 2009 and read uh some forum posts uh, I classify all-wheel drive, again, in the same category as positive camber, which is basically like putting training wheels on your front wheels. Uh, race tires, which is just unrealistic and too much grip for a drift car at that, and if you use race tires, guaranteed those people are using stupid amounts of horsepower too. So basically, it's in the little pot of noob. Um, but again, I come from a competitive background. I'm old school and an elitist uh, when it comes to the topic, so uh, if you have another opinion uh, and are not an idiot, 
and know how to voice an opinion properly, even if it's not the same. If you don't agree with me, that's fine. Just a comment going, oh, you're a fuckhead, yeah. I'm just, you're going to get removed, and if you continue, you get blocked. That's fine. If you want to have a civil argument about it, bring it, man. I I, I, I will debate the, you into the fucking ground. Uh, that just comes across as, like, an, an argument. But no, I have I love having arguments about this because I... It's, I, I like to get into the mind of the people that I don't understand. Um, but, anyway, enough bashing <laughs> people. Um, again, guys, thanks for watching. If you have any suggestions for the next Real Talk, uh, they're not weekly. Yeah, I just put them out whenever I feel like putting them out. Um, please leave them in the description below, or the comment section below. Uh, if you want to join the conversation, feel free, and I will see you next time. Hey, thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of my videos, go ahead and click that subscribe button. I also have a Facebook and a Twitter. For those links, be sure to check out the description box below.